Hey guys, it's me. And in case you notice, I'm missing my tooth again. Long story short, these people want to drill into my jaw to put in a screw, to screw in a tooth with the possibility of it making its way out again. And I'm not spending that kind of money or doing that kind of thing. So I'm trying to get a um, one that I can put in and take out because my body tends to discard anything that is foreign. So every single surgery that I've ever had in my entire life, which has been many, I am very scarred up because my surgical sites have opened up to push out whatever, um, you know, those uh, stitches that are supposed to dissolve, they don't dissolve in my body. My body just kicks them out. And so I end up with, actually, my belly button has a little pokey part <laughs> from one of these things that they put inside of me and it did not want to stay. I had to have it removed. Thankfully, I'm very numb in my stomach area. So um, I did not feel when they were digging in there to pull these stitches out. But my body doesn't like any foreign objects. And I tend to either get really massive infections or my body will just reject it and it makes its way out, which is very painful. As a result, I have made the executive decision that I'm going to stay like this. Honestly, it doesn't really bother me. Um, it is what it is, you know. And eventually I'll get it fixed, but I'm not really bothered about it. So if I was younger, maybe now, meh, I really don't care. <laughs> Anyhow, that being said, hi guys, it's me. So... I went to this store called Pop Lulu, and I did post a video on my um, Instagram showing some of the pictures from over there. It's a really cool store. They just opened it. It's in Edison, New Jersey, and it's one of those stores where they, um, uh, what do you call it? The, it's a Japanese, and it's Japanese skincare, and everything in there smelled so good, and the prices were comparable to buying makeup and skincare stuff at Ulta. It wasn't really expensive. So I ended up getting an eyeliner. And then I got him. <laughs> because they also have all the Japanese snacks, the Kit Kat bars and all the different flavors, the laid potato chips and all the different flavors they have. Um, and it's not a huge place. But unfortunately, when we went, it had, it was like that weekend before, because we went on thurs, Thursday, I want to say we went on Thursday, and the prior weekend was a grand opening, and the lines to get into that place on Mon Saturday and Sunday were going down the, down the pl plaza and around the buildings. And there's a whole bunch of stores. It's like a, an, a like a strip mall kind of thing. It was mom. So we opted to go on Thursday because my daughter's here. And we figured, let's go take a trip over there and check it out. And I really, really liked the store. Unfortunately, it was almost empty. There was just nothing. The aisles were almost bare from people going in there and like buying them out. Which is great for them. You know what I mean? So we're, I'm going to wait a couple of um, weeks, probably at some point next month. I'll try to hit them again and see um, what else they have there. And there was also some hair stuff that I wanted to get because I am going to allow my hair to just go gray at this point. Um, I have, I shaved the sides and the back, so that's why you see I have no hair there. But my hair... A couple years back had fallen out like a lot of it I lost eyebrows from stress my eyebrows I had lost the hair here I had this huge missing patch of hair over here and um 
it finally started to grow in and then I just started a couple months ago to take um what do you call that stuff collagen pep peptides peptides I don't know anyway it's a collagen that you I put it in my coffee in the morning I have it every morning and I also use a couple of things for hair growth and my hair has been growing out like I just have a lot of little hairs right now I'm looking like uh Morticia vampire-ish kind of thing vampira with the with the hair white hair there but um that stuff is working it, whatever I'm doing is working because my hair is starting to grow back my eyebrows have grown back in completely um my skin is a lot better um not as gaunt as I had gotten I had also right before um I had to have my stomach fixed <laughs> I had to have stomach surgery I had uh lost like I don't know 60 pounds and I was just constantly sick I was weak I was anemic you name it they fixed my stomach which I'm missing almost the bulk of it um they had to remove my whole stomach long story and um I have gained weight since this whole fiasco took place um so I'm kind of chunky at this point I'm at 190 and I'm fine I ain't worried about it lost tooth gray hair eh, it's part of aging I'm good anyhow <laughs> we went over there and whatever I'm doing is working for my hair and so I want to go back and get some really really Product, good products that I saw there that I really want to try because I've heard fantastic things about them and um, I want to give them a try but they didn't have the whole set of the you know the shampoo conditioner and all that stuff and I wanted to try the whole shebang so I'm gonna go back and look for it at some point but I did get him I got him and I got snacks the important stuff anyhow <laughs> we did that and then I finished my my mini me and I actually changed her she's got a Walmart bag because I was torturing my husband about going to Walmart today which we did um but I I switched her body out to the um the obitsu body because I want her I find these bodies you can have more expression so but her glasses broke the little they broke and I don't know where, what, where that went, that piece. I was cleaning them and then the next thing I know, this was gone. So, I don't know. I have to look for it. So, she needs new glasses. I have, I have tons of glasses for the dolls because I like them. But I wanted her glasses to kind of match mine. Um, so, I don't know. I have to maybe buy a pair that are more, that match more mine then I got one of these today I got this and then I got this set for the um our generation doll which I don't have I'm getting this for the Blythe dolls but it's a whole like travel kit and I thought it was really cute it was on sale it has a camera it has a chocolate bar a tablet um it has some pictures a bottle water it has uh the travel tickets passport uh eye mask pillow and a whole bunch of other stuff which i'm gonna open this at some point and look through it but i thought it was cute it was 20 bucks on sale so that was a good buy and i'm gonna open this and see if i got my sandworm i doubt it i'm torturing myself over the sandworm that i'm never gonna get i'll get it uh like 10 years after this goes out of style or out of uh, favor over here but let's see let's see what we have in here I'm not gonna make it but I'm going to open it mm, I don't think eh, I'm pretty sure it's not the sandworm I'm pretty sure it's the um the cake that I already have where is the strip to this thing Hold on, here we go. Uh. 
Okay. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's the... I have one of the cakes that has like these little um, bats on the top and I'm pretty sure it's that. So if it is, I will probably, you know, raffle this off or send it to somebody or I don't know. We'll see what it is. Ah. Let's see. Okay, we have the little table. We have that and this is the it's a little shovely thing a little spatula and we have that we have the little placemat this table which I already have so I'm gonna assume it is one of the ones one of the cakes that I already have let's see Uh, yep, yeah. it's the exact one that I thought it would be. Has little bats on the top, and it's a little cake. Um, it's very cute. I'm not gonna say it's not cute. It's adorable. It's a little cake thing. I think this one is it. The yeah, it's two layers. Comes with sprinkles, and then it has the uh the little frosting glaze stuff. Um, the elusive sandworm. I'm never going to get it. But anyway, that's it, guys. That's all I have. My garbage can is my garbage bin is all the way over to the side. I also got, got one of these. The Simski, Simskis. What are these? Simiskis? I don't know. They're cute. But he's a little bathroom dude. Has to go to the bathroom. So he's from that series. And I thought he was cute. And he's supposed to glow in the dark. So I'm going to sit him here and see if he actually does. But anyway, guys, that's it. That's all I think. That's I think that's all I have. Anyhow, I did go to the Renaissance Fair this Saturday. And um, pictures of that are also... I, we took um, Mia, the big smart doll. And pictures of that are on my... Instagram page is doll underscore menagerie underscore you can find me there and if you like this video give it a thumbs up a like leave me a comment and until next time guys bye